Lesson 101 Center Floor, Glissade, and Changement Start in fifth position, facing downstage, right foot in front, both arms down and round. Demi Portebra on the second half of the eight count preparation. The first few times you perform this combination, leave both arms a la seconde. On the counts of seven and eight of the preparation, bend into a demi plie. On the first count, dégage the right leg to the side. On the second count, jump to the side, changing legs. It will look like a small leap to the side. You will now be standing on the left leg. On the counts of three and four, close the right leg into fifth position in demi plie. Repeat the glissade to the left, closing fifth position with the right leg in front in demi plie. Repeat one more glissade to the right, then changement twice. Now repeat the whole combination to the left, three glissade, and then two chashman. Option number one, add the correct arms. During the glissade to the right, bring the right arm to low fifth, leaving the left arm to the side. Repeat with the left arm when you glissade left leaving the other arm a la seconde. During the chashman, both arms stay down and round and in low fifth. Option number two, perform the combination twice as fast. The glissade will be on two counts each, the chashman on one count each. Reminders for the glissade. Always start and finish a glissade in fifth position in demi plie. The feet should be fully pointed the whole time they are off the floor. Both feet are to be the same height off the floor. If one foot lifts four inches from the floor during the dégagé before the jump to the side, the other foot should be the same height off the floor after the jump before you close fifth position. Reminders for the chashman. Push off the floor with both legs evenly, keeping the torso aligned. There will be a tendency for the torso to pull back on the upward part of the jump and for the torso to lean forward on the landing. Do not let the arms help the legs do the jump, as they are to stay isolated and not be moving. Use the muscles in the feet to help the jump. Push off the floor with pointed feet. Make sure the feet are pointed and that the knees are straight when in the air. Land in a fifth position with both heels down and in demi plie. Refer to the training videos for more details on execution of these steps.
Ballet Lesson 101, Center Floor, Chasse, and Pas de Bourre. Start in fifth position with the right foot front facing downstage right. On the first half of the eight count preparation, demi porte bras with the arms. On the count of one, demi plie and slide the right foot forward to a lunging position in fourth position. On the count of two, bring the left leg up behind it, finishing in a fifth position on demi point. Make sure to squeeze the legs together using the adductors in both legs. On the count of three, demi plie to fifth position. Hold in fifth position in demi plie on the count of four. Repeat the movement three times with the right foot in front. After the third chasse to the right, lower with the left foot coupe in back. Now perform a pas de bourre, which is back, side, and front. As you perform the pas de bourre, turn the body a quarter turn to the left, finishing in fifth position, facing downstage left, and with the left foot in front. Now repeat the combination to the left, chasse three times, then pas de bourre. A reminder for the pas de bourre, step to demi point on the back and side steps, and then down, closing to fifth position in demi plie on the third step. This movement does travel, but should stay within the confines of the recommended space. If needed, this combination can also be performed by facing and then traveling stage right and stage left. As an option, this combination can also be performed twice as fast. Refer to the Ballet Obscura training videos for more details on execution of these steps. Ballet Lesson 101, Center Floor, Traveling Balancé, or Triplet Walking. Start with the left foot in front, the right foot in coupé in back, arms down and round. On the first half of the eight count preparation, demi porte bras with the arms. Part 1. Step with the right foot forward into fourth position and start walking. Stay up on demi point as you perform this walk. Count each step as you go. One, two, three, one, two, three. Keep
keep the tempo even. Part 2. Continue the walk, but now step down to a demi-plié each time you step on the count of one. Relevé on the count of two and three. Now you'll be performing an down, up, up, down, up, up movement. Repeat this down, up, up four times, right, left, right, left. After the fourth step, the left foot is in front and the right foot is in back in coupe. Now step up to demi point and perform a bourre turn to the right, staying in the same spot. Change legs as you perform the bourre turn to the right, finishing with the right foot in front and with the left foot coupe in back. Now reverse the combination, starting with the left foot stepping first and a bourre turn to the left. Option, if the space you are practicing in is small, you can perform the triplet in a small circle. Refer to the Ballet Obscura training videos for more details on execution of these steps. Ballet Lesson 101, Center Floor, Ballet Walks. Start in fourth position. Lift the back foot off the floor. First, lift the heel, then the ball of the foot, then point the foot fully as it pushes off the floor. Make sure the foot stays pointed when it is off the floor. Lift through coupe as you extend it to the front to a tendu. Now reverse the down movement, first the toe, then the ball of the foot, then the heel. 
press the heel forward as you step down to fourth position. Now repeat the movement with the other foot. Perform the movement slowly until you are able to execute each part of the movement with a fluid quality. Option: If the space you are practicing in is small, you can perform the ballet walk in a small circle. Refer to the Ballet Obscura training videos for more details on execution of these steps. Lesson 101, Center Floor, Sison, Assemblée, and Padasha. Start in fifth position, facing downstage, right foot in front, both arms down and round. Demi porte bras on the second half of the eight count preparation. The first few times you perform this combination, leave both arms a la seconde. On the counts of 7-8 of the preparation, bend into a demi-plie to prepare. On the counts of 1 and 2, jump into the air off both legs, squeezing the inner thighs together. At the high point, pull the legs apart and land in an arabesque facing down stage right. On the counts of 3 and 4, Jump off of one leg and reverse the movement, landing in a demi-plie fifth position with the left foot in back. On the count of five, lift the right leg to retire. On the count of six, jump, changing legs to finish in retire with the left leg up. On the count of seven and eight, bring the left foot down to fifth position, closing in front, and in demi-plie. Repeat the combination to the left. Sison, assemble, pas de chat. Option number one, add the correct arms and head inclinations. For the first arabesque, facing downstage right, the right arm is extended towards downstage right. The left arm, the head for the Padasha is inclined down and to the direction of the execution of the movement. Option number two, perform the combination twice as fast. 
the Sison and Assemblé will be on one count each, the Padasha on two counts. Reminders for the Sison. Push off the floor with both legs, keeping the torso aligned. Make sure the body has turned and that you land in an arabesque position. Use the muscles in the feet as well as the muscles in the legs to help the jump. Push off the floor with pointed feet. Make sure the feet are pointed and the knees are straight when in the air. Reminders for the assemblé. Land in a fifth position with both heels down and in demi-plié. The assemblé will be much more physically demanding than the sison since you are jumping from one leg. Reminders for the padasha. Always start and finish padasha in a fifth position in demi-plié. The feet should be fully pointed the whole time they are off the floor and underneath your body. Both feet are to be the same height off the floor when going through the retire. Refer to the training videos for more details on execution of these steps. Congratulations, your ballet lesson is done. Make sure to stretch out for your cool down. You can help us get the word out. Give us a like, subscribe, follow, and share.